Community has been changed forever after a gunman opened fire during a church service yesterday in Texas, killing two people and critically wounding another. But it could have been worse. We're explaining that today in our digital dive, because according to police, an armed parishioner who was part of the church's security team shot and killed the gunman about six seconds after he opened fire. Now, the incident was broadcast on a live stream of the service where video shows other church members pulling out their weapons. Authorities say the people who confronted that gunman saved lives. Evil walked boldly among us. But let me remind you, good people raised up and stopped it before it got worse. Now, the shooting comes after a new law went into effect allowing people to carry weapons in places of worship. Now, under the law, licensed gun holders in Texas can bring guns into places of worship unless uh, religious leaders specifically prohibit those web weapons. Now, the state senator who filed the bill said that it clarifies the legislature's intent to treat churches in the same manner as other privately owned establishments in Texas. Now, officials don't know yet if the shooter was illegal or was legally allowed to own a gun, but here's what some of our Sunrisers had to say about this story. Janice said, thank goodness, uh, good guys also had guns and knew how to use them. Uh, imagine how many people would be dead otherwise. Jeff thinks the change in laws was fortunate for the majority of parishioners. He says the gunman who gunman uh, who's the wrong location. And Nathan thinks you shouldn't need a law to carry personal protection. So a lot of people are talking about this story. Let us know what you think by using the hashtag Sunrisers. It's sad all around though. Uh, definitely. Yeah. And I think when this law came out, it was, you know, kind of comical it was looked upon. But in this case, it probably did save some lives. So, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's probably for the better. Yeah. Thanks, Hillary.